<laughs> Good morning. <laughs> okay, so today we are going to be. <laughs> Look at his face. God. <laughs> today I'm going to be taking you guys along with us. We are just going to have a nice, cozy day um, at home, or maybe we'll go for a walk on the beach later. <clears throat> And I'm just going to try and flow. I've tried to pick up the camera so many times in the last little while and yeah, it's it's been proven to be a bit tricky with two children once now that this little one is out of the newborn stage and much more awake and alert and needing our attention. Um, but yeah, my intention for this video is just to show you guys a cozy autumn day here in Australia with our family and um, yeah, just show you all the simple pleasures in life that we are finding lots of joy in lately in this season. And also I'm probably going to have a little chat to you guys later on about time management or lack thereof. Um, and what it's yeah been like for us having two children and trying to get stuff done. Bye. Bye. Um, literally the only time I can film is like Zach is walking out the door. Tallow's already in the car seat Bye. just outside. Um, and I'm like, okay, I'm going to turn the camera on now because it is, <laughs> it's impossible to film at any other time. Oh my gosh, guys, like, they're cute, but they literally take up your whole life. Yeah? Okay. We've just been enjoying these slow days at this time when everyone is kind of enjoying slow days because of what is going on in the world. I need to try and get this camera higher, but... Yeah, we've just been enjoying, you know, being in the garden, being by the beach, um, playing with our children, making all, lots of food from scratch. So we've been making a lot of milk from scratch, almond milk, hemp milk, cashew milk. And yeah, we've been making bread. This is my... Your scissors? Yeah. Oh, darling, you might have to go upstairs. You might have to get Papa. And... <laughs> Exhibit A. Um, yeah, so what was I saying? Yeah, basically I spend my afternoons and my days like cleaning up and making food. But it's lucky that I love doing those things. So yeah, actually I'm just going to get another loaf of bread on now. This is my second loaf. Um, this is a friend of mine, Sarah's, not her recipe, but one that I found through her YouTube channel. Maybe I'll link that below. Um, so it's just like a spelt. This is a spelt and buckwheat mix. I think the original is a gluten-free one, but we didn't have enough gluten-free flour. So yeah, I'm going to get that. It's just been fermenting overnight and I'm going to put it in the oven now. Yeah, let's do it. Okay. So current situation. I feel like our videos from now on may be a lot of just me talking, me being present with you guys when Tal and Zach are outside or have gone on an adventure or something and Oki is asleep because right now that is kind of where we're at. It's very tricky to, as I kind of mentioned before, it's been very tricky for us to, yeah, try and do much of anything really other than be with them when they're awake. Um, Talos specifically at this age and who he is, his personality, like he is someone who needs our undivided attention all the time. Like he does a little bit of um, independent play and he's, and it's so beautiful when he does, but even when he does that, like obviously, I mean, any parent can relate to that. We need to be like pretty much right next to him. Um, but his personality, who he is, he's such a social, interactive, um, vibrant being and that's his personality. And so we just need to try and nurture that as best we can and be with him all the time, essentially when he's awake. Um, and then Oki is obviously three months old now and yeah, just he's either on me or he's sleeping or he's also just so much more awake lately. It's amazing. Like his personality is really starting to shine through as well. I feel like he's going to be very different to Tallow, but yeah, he is a three month old baby. So he needs his mama all the time as well. Anyways, I'm going to show you guys this bread that I've 
left fermenting um, from last night. It's looking so good. Like I'm super excited about it. I wonder if I need to add more liquid. Maybe not. Oiled up this pan. It's like a cake tin or a banana bread loaf tin. Loaf tin. Oh my gosh, it's so sticky. <laughs> I don't know if this is, people are probably watching this like, well, what have you done? That is not how bread is supposed to look. <laughs> yeah, this isn't a sourdough. This is just fermented and yeah i don't know it's very heavy i hope it god i hope it works anyway let's see how it goes okay so i've got to have it on low for 15 minutes and then i have to have it on um like the normal 180 i think it is celsius for an hour so i need to put the timer on so I've just gotten the bread out of the oven and it's it has risen a little bit. But I'm a little bit scared of how it's <laughs> Is it good? Baby. Yeah? Yeah. Oh it's look like at that. Super crusty on the outside. Oh sweet. Oh my god, I I'm so excited. I'm so proud. <laughs> I thought it was up. I didn't think it was gonna work out. Mm. Once it's a butter and hot bread. Yeah. We've got Tallow out here having a snack. Because you've been working hard in the garden, hey? Seriously, what is this day, you guys? So beautiful. This is like what autumn is all about, you guys. Windy, brisk days, warm bread. Oh, you're painting. I figure if I put on some clothes that I um, intend to do yoga or some light exercise in, then I will actually do it. So I'll just see how that goes. But I am actually in love with this outfit. I need to get it back so I can show you. These are linen shorts, which I should probably could pick something better for doing some stretching in, but they're just so comfy. And this is a like sports top yoga top it's got like a built-in bra which is amazing for breastfeeding i just pull this over the side and yeah i just love this outfit so much this whole outfit is from indigo luna you guys probably have heard of this brand if you've been following me over the years because i have been obsessed with them for ages and absolutely love them i'm friends with the owners and they're just such beautiful people i actually have a 10 percent off discount code for you guys that you can use so i'll put it up on the screen here and i'll leave the link to indigo luna down in my description box so that you can check out their clothes if you want or naturally dyed made ethically made in bali so yeah I'll leave you guys the link for that, but let's go see what the boys are up to. Wake up because he's been asleep for a while and he's just gone to sleep. 
so yeah I wanted to quickly talk to you guys about time management but also get in a little stretch I'm just gonna do a 15 minute video um, yeah but we've been finding it really difficult to do the things that we want to do because we have two children and like my root our routine has completely changed or like we don't even really have a routine some days things flow and work and other days it's just like yeah crazy and things don't seem to flow or work and um, I suppose that's just a part of our process right now and I feel like I'm pretty proud of myself because in the past if I don't get like my self-care routine down if I don't have my mornings especially the way that I want them then I really struggle and I end up retreating and becoming really aggressive um, but I've just kind of gotten along with life right now and um, haven't been too bad though I really have moments of feeling just like I need space because I have two children and a partner and then when we do have space we don't even really want to talk to each other we just want to you know like we don't get to spend we don't want to spend that time really engaged with each other we want to spend it doing our own thing so yeah um, I'm trying to figure out if like I've okay so what I've felt that has worked for me today even um, without having a lot of time is that I made a list last night of things that I wanted to do and I prepared some things like I prepared the bread that I wanted to bake etc um, and that really helped me today to feel productive with the things the few things that I did do whilst my children were around in the morning um, and then I'm feeling really grateful that when it comes to this time of the day between two and three I actually get like quite a lot of energy usually I feel like a lot of people um, lose their energy at this point of the day and I think that that this I like I don't know I think that the water that we drink has a lot to do with um, my energy boosts and yeah I'm just like ready I'm like I want to go for like a, like energy like I want to go for a run or I want to do some stretching or whatever um, but I'm still also trying to be gentle on my body because I'm nine no what I'm 12 weeks almost 13 weeks postpartum now so still trying to be gentle but yeah just wanted to like let you guys know that like life is full with two kids and yeah I've been struggling I've been struggling a little bit with it lately um, and having like really amazing beautiful days and today's been one of those days and then other days are just like I just can't wait for them to be over and yeah it's just a part of it all trying to embrace it and learning to surrender to it more and more every day so with that being said I'm just gonna quickly do this 15 minute video and then I'm gonna feel so good so let's see if I get the 15 minutes in before someone wakes up Okay, Papa, take him. Go! Darling. <laughs> Hello, darling. Hello. Hello. Woo! Go lower down here. Do you like that? That's it, little monkey. When you think you're not going to get any exercise done in the day, and then your toddler proves you my rock, wrong. My rock, my rock. Okay. 
I think that pretty much wraps up the video for today. We're gonna go home and have some yummy soup that my mum's cooking us for dinner and have cookies for dessert. Ah, oh, these like, I live for these days. Like these, autumn is just like, probably, no, it's not my favorite season, but it's just such a vibe. Okay, I need to go running now with my little- Gina, go! Okay, Gina, go! Um, thank you guys so much for watching this video. We're gonna see you in the next one. Mom, Darling. Mom. Daddy, me and you go, and then Mama catch us. Okay. Two, no. Go. Go. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you're enjoying our content. I know we aren't getting as much out lately, but I'm sure you can understand that with two little ones, it has been somewhat of a challenge. So we're sending you all our love. We can't wait to keep editing and getting videos out to you guys. And um, yeah, we'll be seeing you in the next video. If you haven't already subscribed, then please do because it really helps support our channel and that way you won't miss a video. And if you liked what you saw during this video, please give it a thumbs up because that again really helps support our channel. All right, big love you guys.